You know you thought about it. <laughs> you know you looked. You went to GameStop and looked at this. Well, look no further. <laughs> I don't know why I got real evil with that, but you know, we'll roll with it. And here we are yet again, my friends, my compadres, my amigos. <laughs> We're unboxing stuff. Not just any stuff, but stuff from GameStop. They got goodies. When I say they've got goodies, now they've got goodies to put your goodies in. <laughs> I love me. I pretty much love everything I do. I'm not gonna lie to you. So here it is, the Atrix Gamer Snack and Play, the probably most useless looking item I've ever seen, but you know what? They, they have been, they have been, they have been taunting me with this. They have been, they, they, it's everywhere. I walk into GameStop and uh, there's one right there. I ring the doorbell, uh, uh, there's another one. I walk over to the counter and say, can I get that, you know, that little pack of magic cards behind the counter? And uh, here, try this out. They've been promoting the crap out of this thing in stores and I just thought, you know what? I gotta get it. So of course I got it. <laughs> <laughs> on sale. Okay, we're gonna unbox this bad boy and, you know, itch that itch. We're gonna scratch that itch. We're gonna scratch it. Scritch is what we're gonna do. Itching with the scratching. Scritch. I made it up. I, gosh, I'm so good. I just, have I not told you how good I am yet? And here we are. <laughs> so remember, what's the first thing that we do when we unbox something? We gotta look for the tape. There it is. <laughs> the old fingernail trick to cut into the tape. Yeah, I did it. And let's pop this puppy open. I'm pretty excited actually because uh, <laughs> I can't imagine this thing being worth the money. There we go, there we go. Got a little plastic cover. Instructions here. Whoa. I can already tell you, this is gonna be real, real neat. There we go. Huh? Now, so, supposedly, this is kind of like a little gyro for your cup. I'm not gonna lie. That's kind of neat. <laughs> you got a little cord, USB charging cord, huh? So it looks like we got a little snack compartment. Okay, let's see if this little cup, oh, this little cup thing is removable. That's cool. It's a little, a little simpler than I was hoping. Okay, we're, we're testing that out to the full extent later. I don't know what this is for. And then that removes. Does the whole thing come out? Or like, is this a, okay, this looks like some sort of power bank. Does it remove? Oh my gosh. Here, the USB port. That's what charges the bank. And then the USB, or the USB-A port is what gives power to something else. Removable tray with docking station for mobile devices. What do you do with this? You just stick them in there? Well, that's a problem. So it appears to be that if you've got a case, good luck. <laughs> Let's see what we got now. Well, that's a thing. This seems silly. I guess the only thing that this is good for is if I'm watching my own stream via this. We'll test out the snack box. Generic candy. Now let's see if it can hold all the M&Ms. I mean, generic candy, shut up. It's like a dream. And now I can cover them up so that they're out of sight and I can never look at them. And look, we can now use it as a maraca. This is for holding snacks. Well, good thing I've got generic candy, I mean generic cereal to use. <laughs> I 
believe it. It holds another snack. That's one snacks, two snacks. This might be the most amazing thing ever created. How about covering up that snack with a little bit of your phone? <laughs> This puppy's machine washable. Not the entire thing, but you know, the separate compartment. So don't wash the whole thing or you're gonna get that power bank in there and you know. So we're gonna wash this little puppy right here, but the only problem is I don't have a dishwasher. But by now you're asking, <laughs> By golly gee willikers, can the gyro cup holder hold your drink without spilling it generic soda? We're about to flip and find out. Looks like I'm ready to test this puppy out. What's that ninjas? <laughs> you want a piece of this? <laughs> Not even a spill. Time to go for a jog. <laughs> Perfect. Not even a problem. What's that? You want a little somersault action? Don't even worry about it. <laughs> this thing's never gonna spill ever in the days of your life ever. This thing's never gonna spill. <laughs> Wait, what? What kind of moron gave it to me and didn't even open the stupid thing, huh? So unfortunately, our stunt man didn't realize that the soda can was not open. So let's go ahead and try and open it real quick. Now let's see how it works out. I see a bit of a problem. It doesn't work. <laughs> so if it won't hold a soda can, let's try some other kind of cup or, or glass. A nice full water bottle. That ought to be fine, right? <sighs> okay. So basically, um, it doesn't work. Listen, I'm not trying to give Atrix a bad name or anything like that, because currently I still use the Atrix Sniper keyboard. You can watch that video. Great keyboard, I love it. It's cheap, efficient, sounds good. I got no problem. And even right now, over here, this light is the Atrix Medium Desktop Streaming Light. I did a video on that. But I gotta tell you, GameStop, Atrix, what are you trying to do here? This is clearly a money grab. This has gotta be one of the worst items I've ever purchased. In fact, what can you call this other than a glorified power bank? Literally the only thing that's good about this is that it has a charging port for your phone or something like that or something else that you might need to plug in temporarily. Why don't just get a power bank and put it in your pocket and have a cord that comes out to plug into your phone? Like this is ridiculous. It's literally a cup for snacks, a bigger cup for snacks, a slit for your phone, and a gyro cup holder that does not work at all. Game stuff. I'm a little ashamed of you, okay? <laughs> this is pathetic. You've done some good products. What is this all about? People out there, lend me your ear. Hear and heed what I tell thee right now. 
Do not purchase this item. It is the worst item I've ever purchased in my entire existence. And I've purchased some bad things. Remember the polar bear shoes? That was scary. I had nightmares. My pledge as a YouTuber slash streamer slash gamer slash dad slash is to tell you when a product is good and when it's just crap. But thanks for watching, you little idiots out there. Uh, make sure to stop by the live stream sometime. I stream on Twitch, DLive, Trovo, and YouTube all at the same time. Make sure to follow me on Twitter and TikTok, and also make sure to not get, don't trip, fall into GameStop, and then accidentally purchase this. And I hope you subscribe because you love me. <laughs> because I love me and I've subscribed. Later, Gators.